I'm going to show you how to play crowded rectangles. This is a two player game and you will need one printed game board that looks like this. It's just basically a big square grid. Um, you need two dice and two different colored markers. So the first player will roll. They got a three and a four. So we'll say that's player blue. They're going to make a rectangle that has three squares down and four squares across. And they're going to write the multiplication problem three times four. Now, if you um, make a rectangle and you don't know the answer to your multiplication problem, you can just count the squares. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So then the next player will go and pink got three times four. That's funny, they got three times four too. Okay, let's make another one just like that. Three times four equals 12. So we're tied so far. Here's a four times five. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. So we'll do four times five equals 20, and this board is filling up fast. Here's a four times two from pink. We can fit that right in here. Four times two equals eight. And what we're doing is we're filling in all of the squares of this board. In a little bit, um, somebody will roll and won't be able to fit their, their rectangle inside the board. When that happens, the game ends. So let's see what happens next. Oh, we're rolling some big ones. Five times four is 20 again. Five times four equals 20. Let's see if pink can get a big one. Three times six is 18. Let's see here. Hmm, let's do one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six. There's not much board left. Three times six equals 18. Let's see if blue can fit anything in here. Five times three is not going to fit there. So our game ends right there. And now we just need to add up the points. So pink has 12 plus 18 plus eight, that's 38. And blue has 12 plus 20 plus 20, which is 52. So blue wins that game. And that's how you play crowded rectangles.